Hey guys, back again. Welcome back to the Snag and Breakdown. I'm Orlando. We are New Home Quality Control. We're a UK wide professional snagging company. We got 10 inspectors UK wide. And in these videos, we'll talk about the snags that we find and how to rectify them, basically. If you're wondering, where's the plant gone? I'm sorry, the plant has died. Also, I'm moving soon, so uh, I've cleared everything out. Everything's in boxes, ready to move. Can't wait. Right then, the Snag and Breakdown. Let's go. Hey guys, back again. We got lots of shockers for you today. Starting off, this is where the manhole comes. <laughs> so starting off, obviously they just need to cut the turf properly around the manhole cover. What the hell was going on there? Who knows? That's ridiculous. Under the turf, that's handy. What do you guys think of the mastic seals to these cast stone sill joints? I'm not a fan. I Who mastic seals a mortar joint? Just leave it mortar, point it properly, and leave it as it is. That's stupid. I think it looks horrific. Look at that. At this property, we've had a little bit of a landslide in the garden. It's not too big of an issue, but it is a bit worrying if they can't do that properly. When they dig out this whole mountain, <laughs> I hope that stays in position. I hope he stays in position too. Um, so they need to obviously put that soil back in place. Probably get the turf laid as soon as possible. And that will help keep the soil in place. And uh, yeah, I hope that mountain stays uh, where it is because uh, you don't want that falling on your head. This air source heat pump is a bit damaged. Look at this. And look at this. It hasn't been installed on a level surface and it's completely loose. That's crazy. So obviously if it's damaged, they need to fix any sort of damage or investigate if it's um, causing any issues. And yeah, it needs to be installed on some sort of uh, level surface and ideally fixed down. Don't really want someone stealing it. Um, yeah, definitely shouldn't be left like that anyway. That's ridiculous. The surface and it's completely loose. Look at that. That is absolutely shocking. Now, guys, who can spot something here? Well, if you can spot it, you've got <laughs> X-ray eyes because they've buried the air bricks about 5,000 miles underground. Look at this. They should ideally be 75 mil above ground. Yeah, so what they need to do at this property is the front garden needs to be lowered, basically. Um, about 100 mil, all of it. Like I said in the video, we should ideally have a 75 mil gap underneath the air bricks. Not, uh, definitely not being covered underground anyway. That is ridiculous. This shower console is ready to give birth. Look. <laughs> So they, they need to either tighten that up or someone needs to investigate it, see what the cause is and uh, fix it. Its waters are broke. Who's the absolute winkle spanner that installed this garden gate? I don't think that's going to work, mate. It looks like the gate's most likely been installed out of wind. Most likely what they need to do is adjust the fence post uh, to fix this issue. We've got a crack and finish to the tiles in the shower, literally. So they need to replace the cracked tile. Easily done. Look at that. This issue, I have no idea how it's been missed. So we got a massive security issue. This window just opens and there's no handle Jesus. installed. Manufacturing issue by the looks of it. There's no handle installed on the on the window. Um, someone could easily just rip that window off from outside. So that needs to get fixed straight away. Because that is a security issue. And uh, that's not good. How is that passed? Why am I noticing that? And not like the site manager or whoever signed off the property or or the whoever installed the window. That is absolutely shocking. Ridiculous. And what an absolutely shocking is going on with this kitchen. We've got a massive gap behind the panels, which equals what? a massive gap. Whoa, 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 whoa. So this wasn't one of my inspections. This must have been someone else's because I can't remember this absolute shocker. Look at that. I don't even know what to say. I wasn't at this inspection, so I don't really know. But um, all these units and the worktop need to be reinstalled and uh, against the wall. Because look okay, at this worktop gap. gap behind the panels, which equals a massive look at gap that. The worktop. You can't have that. That is absolutely ridiculous. Hey guys, back again. We got some absolute shockers today. Starting off, this spindle is. All they need to do is install a spacer. That'll stop the spindle from moving. Jobs are good and winner winner, chicken dinner, next snag. Yeah! The melt with the master gun is back again. Look at th They just need to pull some of that mastic off and remastic it. The state on this. This new post is 24 millimeters out of plumb. That new post could be tied into the ceiling, into walls, into the cupboard, into the stairs. It's an absolute nightmare to fix. If it was 10 mil out, I'd be like, yeah, fine. 24 mil, bit of an issue. I'm glad I'm not fixing it. And uh, the fix isn't easy. 
Uh, it all depends on what the issue is at that property. Um, look at that, it's massively out. And look at this, how would you like your toilet to be, sir? I'd like the pond upgrade. But most likely, there's either a block drain at the property, or maybe there's an issue with the Durga valve. Maybe there's a test bung uh, left in the SVP. Um, hopefully, an easy fix. Please, and how would you like your shower to be, sir? I want it to be like a paddling pool. I want it to be like a paddling pool. Um, yet again, possible drainage issue. That is ridiculous. Back on Earth, why are we using screw caps on the balustrade in that space? No, I hate it. I really hate this one. This one is ridiculous. Like the size of these bananas. Look at this. Anyway, so what are you doing? Let's go back. Let's let's run it back. What are you doing putting screw caps on a handrail? Okay, so what you do, you don't use screw caps. So you countersink the screw into the timber and then you fill it. Be a real carpenter. Stop being an idiot the balustrade and that space has been cut short how do they fix a space that's been cut short by not cutting it short cut it again absolute tuna melt in this loft we can see the extraction fan hasn't been connected to any so they need to connect it because otherwise that's just going to be blowing moisture into the loft and it's absolutely shocking ridiculous next in, so all the moisture is going to blow straight into the loft and on this brickwork well there's look at the state of that the apocalypse finish again look the apocalypse finish, the more knock it down finish. Look at this. Look at the state on that. That is absolutely shocking. So they need to repoint it, obviously. And check out the finish to this party wall Jesus inside this loft. This Christ. is absolutely ridiculous. So they've boarded it out of five billion different pieces of Five billion? Board. None of it's stuck a lot. to the wall properly. Look at this. Com so they need to pull all that plasterboard off. Stop messing around like an absolute tuna melt and plasterboard it properly make sure it's fire safe and win a winner chicken dinner like what sort of finish is this this is like you got a child and you went oh come here but i need you to uh, plasterboard the wall can you do it for me Yay! what is going on why are these bananas so big next snag completely loose how is that fire safe that is shocking and what shocking absolute num -num is going on with this what is going on with the shower why is it so far to the the side why is it so far to the side? Shower position. Look at that. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. A massive amount of issues today. Starting off, look at the state of this patching at this handed. Look at the state of this patching. That is shocking. Property. So they need to patch it and paint it better than what it is. Because whoever left it like that, what are you doing? Look at this. Who's the. What is going on? They've installed both components of the security chain on their side. And nobody's noticed it. And everyone walks past this door. And it's been signed off by a warranty provider. It's been signed off by a site manager. And no one has noticed. That is mental. That is absolutely shocking. Absolute tuna melt that installed this security chain on its side. This extraction hood is loose. Look. So tighten her up then, please, but... Look at this. The wood butcher is back again, attacking more door lining. So what they need to do with this door lining is replace it, but they're not going to do it. But what they're really going to do is they're going to get a painter in who's going to fill it and paint it and sort it out and make it look better. Hopefully, make it look perfect. Look at that. Who's the winkle spanner that did this skirting mic? What is this mic there? That's not even a mic there. That's a... That's a... I don't even know what that is. That's like, it. That's hard to do. That is, like, that is so bad. That's hard to do. The joint. There's an old Welsh saying: If your mitres don't fit, fill them with glue and shit. If your mitres don't fit, fill them with glue and shit. I like it. Wallplay strap hasn't been screwed in. What is going on? How has this been signed off yet again? What are, are people like? Like, how has this been signed off? What is going on? Site manager, do your job. The guy who's installing the wallplate straps, do your job. Warranty providers, do your job. Like, what are you doing? Screw it down. The whole point of wallplate strap is to hold down the roof, right? Okay, moving on. To the wallplate, we've got a nail protruding this fence. Jesus. Um, I don't know how you missed that. 
what they need to do they need to remove it obviously and no guys it's not happy to see me here we've got another case of if you can't see it, it doesn't what is going on massive hole in the wall tidy can't see it doesn't matter doesn't matter behind these radiators we've got massive holes in the walls so that needs patching repairing that is Sorted shocking. Out. This fascia is heavily marked. Look at this. Why can I pull screws out of hinges? Oh. My hands that so they need to reinstall these hinges properly. Um, they might even have to change the door if the screws aren't staying in properly. Shocking. It's shocking. And, well, were you expecting us not to see the mastic seal missing? or? Uh, how did these things get missed? I don't understand it. Clients are living in these houses. People are living in these houses. So they've been handed over. How did you miss that? It's easy to see. So easy to see. What are you doing? Look at that. Just remove the radiator and seal it. It's easy. That's, that's ridiculous. Okay, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope that uh, explained the issues a bit better for you and how they get rectified. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button, comment below, subscribe, do all that good stuff. You know what to do. And until next time, I'll see you later. Peace.